My name is Nadia and I am from Zimbabwe. So today I am going to talk about how menstrual hygiene management education or advocacy supports girls in reaching to their full potential. So menstrual hygiene management education or advocacy supports girls in fulfilling to the, their full potential. How? It helps them boost their confidence and they can safely, calmly and comfortably talk about menstruation wherever they are and they feel free to express themselves and define what menstrual hygiene is. So today it has supported girls to fulfill their potential by being confident. Hello, my name is Alice Jaima and I'm from Malawi and I'm here to share why menstrual hygiene management is important to me. It is important because it has taught me a lot of things. I know how to trace my period dates and I know different ways of managing my periods, such as using sanitary pads, the usable sanitary pads, and how I can make them, menstrual, uh, menstrual, menstrual cup, and also the tampons. And all this because of menstrual hygiene management, because it is, it, menstrual hygiene tackles uh, all these stuff. And it is good for a girl child to know all of this, because it is good for her healthy and also physical well-being and wherever she will be. Hey everyone, my name is Jasmine from Tanzania. Let us see some barriers girls face during the menstrual hygiene. Let us start from those who are in government school. In government school, we face some challenge as a girls. Most of government schools, they don't have water in toilets, they don't have soap, doors and ropes. And this is the difficulty because we, in the moment girl is in a period, he wants a room for privacy in order he can change the pets. Also, we have girls in rural areas. Those who are living in rural areas, they don't have most information concerning about menstrual hygiene. And most of girls in rural areas, they use clothes in, instead of sanitary pads. Hello everyone, I'm Uwashiro Nishika. I'm from Bangladesh Girl Guide Association. So today I'm going to uh, tell you guys about one of our projects in MHM uh, and about the outcome of the work we did. So the best thing was uh, the Roses World we did. Uh, because of the story of Roses, children was able to relate their their own story with, with Roses. And because of this, they could uh, they were opening up and they were talking about their experience of their first period and how they're managing it and even when we are giving them advice about how to manage their period and how to be healthy uh, what to eat what to what not to eat and what to do what not to do so they were able to do it because of this and this was the outcome of our work thank you so this was team zambia today we talked about uh, why mhm project matters to us Thank you for watching.